the other day. Scooped. Yeah. We, we, is that a thing? Let's, don't abuse bagels, guys. No, please, God. They are your friends. Yes, bagels are delicious. But uh, you know who is not a friend right now? This dog. Man's best friend turned into, well, I guess if you're fighting a robot, you're still man's best friend. Duck Hunt Dog oh. will be there to help us in the robot apocalypse. Yeah, relatively, I would say. Look, if I'm fighting a dog or a robot, I think I'll take my chances with Kujo over there. So right now we have Fawn versus Dill. We are getting into it now. Fawn looking like a killer out here. Having taken down Mystery, looking to do the same to Dill. I don't know what Fawn and Dill's set record is, but... Like, it's probably in Dill's favor, but if Fawn keeps playing the way she's been playing, then, you know, she's got this. Case in point, that pivot up tilt was clean. I don't know what Fawn is on today, but uh, keep it up. All right, good camping in the air, approaching with a neutral air. Remember, side B is frame one. <laughs> Can is frame one. The character needs it, we swear. That's just Lovecraftian knowledge right there. Beyond my mortal understanding. Ooh, that was close. Nice. And looking like a clean three stock here. Fawn just keeps this momentum up. Feeling herself now. Good lord. Oh, on stream. Alright. Good dash attacks in. And a good use of the gunman just Ooh. down below to cover any sort of low recovery. The first stock taken. And it's probably, probably won't gyro. be the last. What do we see here? Some good pressure staying out of Rob's range. And a nice cross up. Oh, I get spot dodging, away. not getting the down air though. That was so close. Back air, yep. And we're moving on to game two, shaking their head to be like, whoa, I didn't even know I had that in me. Just saying like, I did that shit? Did I, that shit. I was like, that's me? I'm her? God damn. When they're looking at the VODs, they're gonna be like, yeah, I'm cool. All right, it does look like it is in Dill's favor looking up this head-to-head. -head. They have won, they have played 46 sets together, and Fawn has won 17 of those. Okay. So not, so yeah, I suspected Dill had the winning record, but not by, you know, a super big discrepancy. Hey, it's never too late to start closing the gap. But Fawn just doesn't want to close this gap here. Very content to keep Dill away here at a distance. One. Mm, not getting the not getting the follow-up. Just throwing things left, right, and center, my lord. Yeah, we're trying to clean house. Uh-oh. Whoo! That All was right. clean with it. What do we see here? No challenge off stage. If that was me, I definitely got clocked. Dill just setting up gyro, holding shield. If you don't have to approach, why would you? As her going back consistently with these uh, can threats. Not dead, but just about. Dill has slowed this game down to a why did, crawl and now going in. Why did that up here miss? Which one? Like, like that duck was entirely in Rob's body, but it missed clean through, and she got the sour spot down there instead. I'm gonna call Zares, and I'm gonna call Z-axis shenanigans. Z-axis, you miss a character that big? I don't know. Listen, the Z-axis works in mysterious ways, but not that up air. I, I say that. Going down the first I stop. say that, but Brawl DDD spot dodge existed. <laughs> that shit was egregious. Anyway. And a good weight on the spot dodge as they set up this gunman. The, the can just falling to its death slowly. You think all of Duck Hunt's cans are recycled? I would hope so. They use so the many. Throws out, yeah, he throws out a lot. Well, what's it recycled from? <gasps> oh my god. It's other robs. Other robs. You heard it. That, you know what? That would be a working theory if Duck Hunt were playable in Brawl. 
Because <laughs> uh, if, if you played subspace, you know what happened to them robs. <laughs> Makes me sad every time. Character is an endangered species, my lord. You know you can just make more of them. Not, not in Smash Brothers, you can. This apparently. is just this artificial scarcity that Nintendo wants us to believe in. Just well, like Amiibos. Well, the demand's also not there for robotic operating buddies, I'd imagine. I mean, in the future, we will. Will we? Oh, yeah. I mean, hey, you know, the uh, the gray tsunami is coming. You heard it here, folks. Oh, and that up smash almost taking Fawn's life. One. A two. Can's going up, but it's got to come down. Back here. Ooh, not quite. What's stronger, Clay Pigeon or Gyromite? I mean, one is frame one. The other is one of the most obnoxious items in the game. They're both pretty good in their own rights. All right, nice neutral air. Getting this damage. Even in percent, but uh, Rom being a heavy killer. Fonz really got to fight for a confirm. Ooh, that was close. Wow. Angled it down to catch the jump through platform. Who knew it went through platform? Okay, Vaughn trying to mix it up here? Yep. Yeah. Unfortunately, it is still duck hunt recovery. It's very easy to intercept. Yep, at 148, this is a dangerous buddy. Gunman once more trying to cover the ground. They tripped? It's coming back. I swear the ghost of Brawl haunts me every day. 180, Dill still clinging on to life. Throwing the gyro away. They're gonna forget another one. On trying to set up. Still can't find this kill with any tilts. And he can. Maybe a back air, no grab. That's it. Finally finding it, but 61%, they're gonna be fighting back from a deficit. Not one that's super hard to make up against Rob, because, you know, Rob is big. But look at this wall. Jumping away, zooming around. But she does need to stay focused to punch this out, I agree. And Fawn has been so focused this whole bracket. Poking shield there. Not just yet, but they got the gyro. Work I would have I would have held on to it a little more. Just No! It just covers everything! That honestly that was a good read. It was, it was. She could have gone down, but I mean Dill could have followed with a down air or even just drop and do the gyro arms. Not a checkmate situation, but one that both tried to Oh yeah. I see, I see. Cause Fawn saw that coming and tried to cancel it out with a move, but it was just too late. Start the battle. He could, yeah, she she committed to up air there. Yeah. Otherwise, otherwise it was probably an air dodge, like straight down. Yeah, that would have had enough time to make it back. Three, two, All right. One, go. Ah, but Sagat stage music, a classic. Two of the best to ever do it here in New York in game three. Both of them are swinging out the gates. They're like, all right, I don't want any of this uh, to time BS. I want to be able to actually kill. Let's make this a like, good fight. Oh, do it again. Not quite. <laughs> Both return. Give me out. Give me out. Oh, my God. They're like, hey, fancy seeing you here. But that's just a momentary truce being like, hey, we're, we're going to make it back, all right? I mean, Rob could have still swung and, and recovered. If Duck Hunt swings after a B, they just fall. Yeah, that wouldn't have worked. Oh, my gosh. Taking a place over and oh. over. Up air? Yep. Not killing. Wow, him. good guy. Duck versus robot. Who wins? Oh. I do like the up toss and gyro. It's a good idea just to get that out of the way. Not able for, for Rob to actually get another one in. Can finally taking it. You can blow up robots. Oh. Terminator 2 showed us this, but dogs also do go to heaven. We're running around, avoiding the lasers. 
What would be the best way for Dill to approach this situation? Because it looks like they're playing the most defensively. Well, I mean, that's a great start. Almost to the stock right there. I'm trying to get that back aired. Doesn't make it. I can't hit and shield. Setting everything up. That gyro just floating around in the air. Oh, this definitely getting out of control. All right, Vaughn's got to focus here. Possible last stock of winner's side. Deal locked in, focused. Practically one whole stock ahead. This is for winner's side grand spot. They got to be thinking from loser's side. Do you want to fight a dog or do you want to fight this Rob? Really, neither a good choice. I mean, if that were me, I'd just be surprised I made it that far in the beginning. With. Be like, whoa, I'm just happy to be here. All right, all right. Put on pressure. Ooh. All right, both throwing everything out. Vaughn uncharacteristically getting hit by their own can. It might have went off by itself. It went off by itself. Oh, good read. Hold wow. on, we still got a game. Hey, finally got your up smash. No, but for how oh long do we have God. a game? Okay. Vaughn has reset this to neutral. Able to shield through things. One. Oh, it didn't detonate. Oh my gosh. Not really a flub on Fawn's part, but just tensions rising. This is last stock. Winner's side. It's gonna be 2 0 with Bacon. Woo! No! And Dill takes the set. Fawn having played so hard, so frustrated. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah give hug it, it out. out. Aww. Friendship. No fatalities here, folks. Yeah, just Only put, good just vibes. Put the, when you get something like, if you get something wholesome like that after a set, just put up the MK friendship. Can we please? That'd be so funny. Isn't it friendship? That was like a little question mark. Oh Shao Kahn being like, what? Kill each other. That was a very good set, though. Just so close on both ends. Some great setups there. A good can. Dill just running into that can. What we see here. Really, the rotor arms, oh my gosh. At that point, you weren't making it back. Yeah, those rotor arms are such a checkmate move. Yeah, this right here, this is just a raw read. Got him! Yeah, it's like, hey, if you're going to approach and uh, not hold shields, I'll kill you. And then the heartbreaker. And then, yeah, just... Doo -doo. Well, the good thing was Dill didn't go to chase, because that neutral air would have stopped their approach and would have allowed Fallen to actually get back down and reset the situation. <laughs> Oh yeah! Come on in. For the Amazing. Friendship. You love it. Well, I'm well done. Yes. And that's gonna be that's gonna be my final set of the night for real this time. Before, oh man! Before departing, I'm on. A, I'm sorry to do it before, right before top four. I but, know. Uh, I know. You know, duty calls and whatnot. And I also promised some games to a couple people, so I gotta make good on that and then schedule. But again. I've been Sonic Fiend. Thank you all for tuning in, hanging out with us. As always, support your locals in these somewhat uncertain times. Because, you know, they... We'll find out next week, right? <laughs> that, literally, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> well, well, here's the thing. Here's the thing. One thing you can be certain about is that we're always going to be here playing Smash. Whether it's licensed, unlicensed, it's your support. Locals Lord will be fine. Us here. Yeah, locals, locals are going to be, be fine. fine. Yeah, we'll, yeah, we'll be here. Yeah, yeah. we'll be here. That's certain. Yeah. We're not but giving up. But to stay up. here, we need to keep the lights on. Wait to stay here. And that depends on all of you. Yes. Are we changing Whatever venue? You? Subscribe. I, I hope not. As in, like, exist. Yes. On this planet. Ethereal. Anyway. Okay. Uh, Have a yeah. great night, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> all right. We'll see you later. Right, you want Stage hazard. Yeah, what's up, Swiss? Oh.